Hi, I'm Gavin mcgowan Madhuv. I'm the Sales Manager for Emporia Brands for England and Wales. I spent about 14, 15 years working behind a bar, from pulling pints in the pub to uh, running a bar in a five-star hotel. Uh, I knew Emporia Brands about 10 years ago when I met the owner James Rackham uh, discussing Chairman's Reserve and Armagnac. Uh, then I joined them two years ago now and we had the wonderful Irishman on our portfolio so that's how I got involved with it. I love not just the taste but I love the fact that it's got a great story behind it with Bernard and Rosemary Walsh being a family business as we are, uh, truly believe in their product as we believe in it too. It's easy. Uh, it's easy to work with them. They're, there's no nonsense. Uh, they've got a great product. We love it. Uh, we have fun selling it and tasting it with people. And it's just really easy to work with. They've got passion for their product as we do. Distillery is about an hour south of Dublin in Carlow, and it's actually a newly built distillery that is just commissioned this year. I think with the explosion that's going to be happening over the next five years in Irish whiskey with 50 distilleries in planning, some of them are happening now, outside of the three main ones, uh, it will get garner more and more attention. It has a different flavour profile to scotch, which I think makes it a bit more approachable for the consumer and gives them something different. I think it's hard to get it done, um, it's easy to put planning permission in. No it's not, this is my fourth or fifth time now. I love it, uh, no better place in Bethnal Green to be in the, than in the sun. Uh, whichever one's got a drink in front of me, preferably the Irishman. It's making it accessible for consumers, it gives them gives them a little push to try something they wouldn't normally try and try it in a way they wouldn't try it and then once you draw them in you know you've got them once you've got them and then they'll be buying it uh, and trying different things and being able to take recommendations from the guys who really really know their stuff. Oh, depends on my mood. With the Irishman, uh, I'm loving the uh, cold Irish coffee that they're doing uh, down the road at NOLA and I'm really excited to try the drinks down here at the Sun. I think it, it depends on the expression. Um, I think the founders goes with nice fresh ingredients like apples and apple juice. Uh, once you get to the 12, I wouldn't do much with it apart from putting a nice big ice cube. Uh, the single malt, which has got a sherry cask, it's the only one of the range that doesn't have just bourbon. Um, I think that lends itself to more stirred drinks, uh, Rob Roy styles, Manhattans, works well with Sue's, works well with beer and products like that. <laughs> Why would you make a man choose between those two? I'd have to go Scotch Egg, but done properly. Both. Enjoy the Irishman, enjoy uh, the boom in craft spirits, in well-made spirits, not just craft spirits, but just well-made products, uh, made with love, care and attention from great family businesses.